Environmental scientists have combed canals that feed into Donna Lake for nearly 20 years, searching for polychlorinated biphenyls or PCBs. Uh, this water is actually the, uh, the drinking water uh, for the city of Donna. Uh, and it's also being used for agricultural purposes. Even though PCBs are known to cause cancer, the EPA says this water is safe to drink. But eating fish caught here is bad for your health. It's been a long process, but now scientists say they're one step closer to finding the source of the pollution. We installed uh, seven what we call passive sediment samplers. Uh, what it is is a canister, a metal canister with a, a membrane inside the canister. Uh, we'll throw them in the water, leave them here for a month, come back, collect them, and then analyze the membrane. They say each trip to the site is crucial to pinpointing the exact spot where the pollution started. And where we're finding the most contamination is from here up to around this area. The EPA is working closely with Donna City officials who will eventually play a part in the cleanup process. City officials have big plans for Donna Lake. They want to make it a recreational tourism destination, but they can't do that until the source of the PCBs is found. One of the long-term goals for the city of Donna is to try to create a, uh, a uh, equal tourism site. They want to add parks and trails and hope bird lovers will come. But the top priority is safety and finding the source of the pollution is the key.